So no, definitely, just, uh, just uh, stop, stop chasing the flamingos. Not run very well with the legs. YouTube, how's it going? It's Multiplier here. Multiplier here to tell you about an idea. The idea is this, well in fact it's a sentence, and the sentence is you can learn more from a bad song than you can a good song. What do I mean? Well, basically, if you're listening to a good song, a good tune, a good track, a good piece of musical art for the ears, then everything is normally anyway just, just working, and, and that's fantastic. And it can be really hard to figure out what's working, why it's working, and, and therefore it can, be, it can be quite difficult to learn. However, if you're listening to a bad song, sometimes it can be easier to pick up on why you don't like it. And this can be useful. You hit play, you listen to the song, and 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 you don't like it. It's a bad song. Now, what's interesting here is if you then analyze it, you can start to learn about why you don't like it. Maybe, maybe the intro's too long. Maybe the intro's too long, too boring, not enough happening, it hasn't captured your attention, and therefore you can learn from it. You can learn from this, and then maybe you can apply that to your own productions. Because the, 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 here, here's the problem. When you're writing your own song, it's almost impossible to see it objectively. It can be almost impossible to see your own track in the eyes of somebody else. And so it can be, it can be really hard to understand what might or might not be working with your track. Because you've spent so long writing your song, it can be really difficult to look at it objectively. And so it can be useful to look at bad songs to see what doesn't work in their songs, and therefore, consciously or subconsciously, you can then apply that to what you're doing too. Other examples of, of things you might not like in bad songs, but of course, I, I do recommend doing this for yourself. Try and find some bad songs and try to articulate or just try to figure out what you don't like about them, and that will help you write, write, that will help you write your own good songs. Examples of things to look for in bad songs, Maybe it's not that dancey, maybe it's supposed to be dance music, but you're listening to it and, and you just... Not dancing at all, whereas instead it should be sort of... Techno, or... Dubstep, uh, if you know how to... A good song will get you... Not in your head or, or moving about instinctively without you, or it, as I say, it could, 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 could the dub steps where you just want to rage, and, and that's kind of like dancing too. Other critiques of bad songs that you can learn from: maybe you're listening to a song and, and you're listening and going, brilliantly made, brilliantly, fantastically made song, but it's it's just just standard tech house or it's just standard bass house doesn't get me excited. Or maybe the build-up doesn't transition into the drop section. So you get excited and then your brain gets all scrambled and jarred from the transition from the build-up to the drop. Maybe that structurally puts you off the bad song. The things are the things that are the things. Maybe it's too repetitive and there's not enough change throughout the track. It feels like they've got two loops and just extended it. Not really done anything with it. No automation or, or not enough automation. Not enough variation. Maybe the chord progression just loops eight times in a row or four times in a row, and maybe you, f you feel it'd be better if it had some sort of a change halfway through and it went and then it, it got more and more exciting, melodically, chord chordally, uh, harmonically, uh, etc. So give it a go. It's an interesting idea, I think. Instead of just, I mean, still analyze good songs. Instead of just analyzing good songs, analyze bad songs and try to work out why you don't like it. Fantastic, my name has been Multiplier and I will catch you guys. Catch you guys on the... We'll catch you guys on the... First time. Flippity. Oh, Great thing I've ever done. Flippity. Drop the mic. Drop the. Uh, drop the flippity flip. Do it flippity flip. Catch on the flippity flip. Oh, so good.